While studying for the CFA exam and while doing my taxes this year, I realized I spent $1,200 on energy drinks. I was working as an engineer last year. You know, you go into the office early, I drink caffeine to stay awake. A lot of people drink coffee and they pay for $4 cups of coffee at Starbucks, but I was drinking these energy drinks at the liquor store down the street from my job. They were two for three thirty-five. dollars but the problem is sometimes I would have to come into the office late at night to work on the project, so I'd buy more. So the total that I spent on these came out to about $1,200 last year. Then I decided to model this and say, okay, how much money am I going to lose if I keep going with this habit? It's really easy to enter that and do one of these financial calculators. These uh, functions right here, the time value of money functions, you just enter it in. We're gonna do it on a monthly basis. What I'm gonna do is calculate if I continue drinking energy drinks all the way till the time I retired, which is probably 40 years from now when I am 65 years old. Okay, so let's do the math. Well, we're not really gonna do the math. I'm just gonna have the calculator do the work. On the calculator, the time value of money functions, we have N. 40 years, but we're gonna be compounding monthly. Interest rate, what are we gonna use for the interest rate? I'm gonna use 10%. 10%, okay. Present value, let's start with 10 grand, because you need to start with something. And we have to enter it as negative into our calculator so we get a positive future value. At $1,200 a year, I am going to be making a monthly contribution to this account of $100, negative 100. And then uh, future value, that's the, that's the one we're looking for. Future value, now this is shocking, but I wanna show you how big of a number this is. Also, for the interest rate, I forgot, we have to divide by 12. Otherwise, we're gonna get a ridiculous figure here. 10% per month would be nice, but that's not gonna happen. I actually quit drinking energy drinks after I did this calculation. So this is how much money I'm gonna have available to me in the future because I stopped drinking energy drinks. 1,169,414.59. Now, I'm not telling you to quit energy drinks or whatever your bad habit is, but I'm just putting things in perspective. People are asking me, how did you buy that Viper? How did you do this? Well, I do things by doing the math and saving my money. I learned to save and I learned uh, all this stuff about how money works. And so it's very important to do this stuff for your own personal finances. Again, I'm not telling you what to do, but the numbers are there and it is what it is. So it's kind of important. So some people have been asking me how I trade my stocks and I'm going to go over that. So if you want to know how to do that, subscribe to my channel. Now maybe you want to learn more about dividend stocks or something like that. So you can watch this dividend stock video. Or maybe you don't care about that stuff and you want to watch a car video. Here's my Viper review video. I bought my Viper when I was 24 years old and I realized it was a bad decision because it attracts all sorts of bad attention. So thank you guys for watching and enjoy your car and good luck with your life.